I think the reason this is so important to me is because our focus is building school culture. I loved my time in school. And anytime I'm on the road and I meet a student that's in pain, even when I meet adults that tell me things like, I'd never go back to middle school, or high school was the worst time of my life, it just pains me. And the students I meet on the road that feel bullied, they feel isolated, they feel targeted, they literally feel like they're the only one going through it. But what I've found in my travels is that that's not true. Please stand and remain standing if you've ever been punched, kicked, tripped or shoved on purpose by someone else. Stand up if that's ever happened to you. All of us have been through it before. And if we're willing to be honest about it, if we're willing to kind of take that mask off and really talk about these hard issues, we start to find that we have more in common than we think. So how do we build school culture? If you are great with your messaging on campus, you have a strong activity program, and you are driving people to live in relationship with each other, you will start building that connected campus. We want to create an interactive environment for you and your staff to really talk about school culture and talk about these social emotional needs. We provide a full audio video experience that will really tap into their emotions and get them thinking differently about the issues on campus. But most importantly, we're going to do the work. Like we're going to pull out the paper, pull out the pens, get to know one another, get to know your student population better and come up with real solutions. Back in 1999, it was about giving students a voice because of Columbine. And that's what Teen Truth is today. It's all about giving students a voice. One of the things I enjoyed about this presentation was the fact that it brought to focus that it has to be student driven. Really empower our students to be the difference. He clearly has energy and he's very passionate and organized about what he's talking about and has a good system to follow. I want to share with you one last story. My friend's name is Ryan Bellflower. And Ryan, he's a little different than most of us. All right, Ryan grew up with a learning challenge. He went to a school that was just like your school. And when Rhino went there and those students met him, instead of knocking him down, they encouraged him to explore his talents. And during senior night, the last game of his senior year, the players on his team took upon themselves to show Ryan that love. He's went his whole life for this one moment to do something people told him he'd never be able to do. Nothing but net, drains a three-pointer at the buzzer, yeah! Now that's a defining moment. You see, he believed in himself, and he believed in himself because he had people around him just like you. And I believe if your school culture can have strong messaging and people connected in real relationships, that amazing things can happen on your campus too. Thank you so much, you have a great day. Thank you so much for your time.